Hi, I'm Ian Pease and I'm the Conservation Ranger here for the National Trust at Hatfield Forest. I think Woodfest is all about Hatfield Forest. It's all about Hatfield Forest being a beautiful, unique, ancient working forest. Woodfest is about creating a connection between people and the forest. I've been sort of running wood fests for the last 11 years and it kind of started originally as a wood fair. So it was pretty much an open day where people would come and buy timber for sale, we'd have a working sawmill. When I took it on in 2003 I kept it as a wood fair for the first few years and it became apparent to me that this was a good site for a festival to celebrate Hatfield Forest. What we actually do is just the conservation of this ancient forest but also there was a lot of room for creativity, more music because it involves uh, local musicians, uh, local tradespeople, local businesses. So we've got traditional wood turners. So we've got traditional timber hewing. We've got a blacksmith because there were originally blacksmiths in the here, so far from fencing. So it's got that traditional heart. And out of that comes the more creative, so we've got, you know, face painting, we've got a bit of clothing, we've got jewellery, um, and we've got those other, other things that are just a bit quirky, a bit more creative, um, and a bit different, so people have a bit of choice, but also an important part of any festival is to have that choice. I'm a firm believer and the National Trust is all about teaching children about these wonderful places and People come to all sorts of countryside sites like Hatfield Forest and other National Trust sites to enjoy them for what they are, to go hiking and walking and that sort of thing. And in my mind, I'd like people to come to, to here and also enjoy being at a festival here because it's a different experience. People come and walk their dogs here and, and have all sorts of experiences, but you know, we have a festival here and it's something to be proud about and it's something that children will remember. Yeah, I'm keen to keep it a free festival because I think the moment you put fencing up and you have security on every gate it becomes a different thing. What's nice about the forest is a person walking their dog just walking through the site for 10 minutes is part of it. Someone that's here all day listening to music is also part of it, it's inclusive. And also because the bands are local, um, all the bands and musicians that play here do so for nothing. They're, they're giving their music, they're sharing their music for the weekend, the same way that we're sharing the forest for the weekend it's, and joining in a celebration. Patrick, a toy and a hole, a scrap, a scars and a silent knot, so a lap and a lap and a top of the gaps in between, right?